Welcome back, Harbor Freight 4x6 Bandsaw. This episode, pushing the limits. I've had this uh, piece of railroad tie for quite a while. I've kind of roughed out a horn for an anvil and I've used the surface for an anvil quite a bit, but it's always been too long. I rough cut all this with a torch a long time ago. Never really thought I had the torch to cut through the whole thing. Now that I've got this saw, I'm going to test its capabilities. Now to do this I had to remove the uh, actual vise because this is 7 inches wide versus and the, the saw blade from guide to guide I have that 7 inches no problem. Figure the worst that will happen is I'll trash a blade so let's see what we get. just having to take the vice off. Now that we're getting into the base of this, I've got to imagine that there's a lot of chip loading on the saw blade and the teeth, but that, that will cause the blade to just skirt over the metal. But we've still got actually some pretty good chips coming off of the end of this blade so it's looking pretty good so far. like with the angle of the saw I know you can't let's see if we get you the view I'm not with the angle of the saw on this I don't have teeth over here on this side before I'm actually leaving the bottom edge of this side so I don't even get the full cut really I guess all that really matters is I continue to get the uh, chips coming out of the blade here. I gotta say, I'm very impressed amazing that this all can do this. So at this point I can noticeably flex the piece of material. But we don't have very much further to go. saw cut. 